say thank you to all the authorities and all the people that have put the time and effort to look for my help, putting their time and effort looking for my daughter and, and being able to find her under the circumstances which we were hoping we were, that it was going to turn out this way. But um, I, I have a lot, a lot of thanks to give to a lot of people and even even the townspeople that have put their time and effort putting signs up and stuff mm -hmm. for me. And, uh, for, for the family to help, help us all out. Yeah, I know it'll, it'll probably be easier, sir, if you have somebody turn down the volume on your telephone, on your television, rather, while we're talking. It might be a little easier for you to hear. Have you had a chance, Mr. Laro, to speak to your ex-wife, Selena's mom? No, I haven't. Um, have you spoken to her during this uh, week-long period that Selena's been missing? No, I haven't. Uh, I know you've had medical problems of your own. You were actually hospitalized the time that she went missing um, and, and found out while you were in the hospital that she had disappeared. I'm curious why you haven't spoken to her mother. Um, it, 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 it's, a, it's a hard question to ask me because I was so worried about where my, where my daughter was you know, missing and you know, trying to put two and two together where, where she could be, you know. And, I, I couldn't believe that, you know, that she was the type of person that would walk and leave, leave a household, especially a household that supposedly gave her great love, you know, and that's what she always told me. And, mm -hmm. and uh, that's, you know, how can you question somebody that she's, to me, she's always been a good mother to her, uh, to both the children, both the girls. Every picture we see of your daughter, she's got these beautiful eyes, long brown hair, and, and often a big happy smile that we see right now. Um, how do you remember your daughter? this evening beautiful beautiful just a wonderful hearted person and uh, just someone who's loving and caring to to a lot of people not just one in, in one the individual, individual person had great love for those towards the family friends everything mm -hmm. what can you go ahead sir that's how I'd like to remember her. Yeah. What can you tell us about her stepdad, your ex-wife's um, present husband, Mr. Noyes? How long have they been married? Dad, I'm not sure. I think over, I think I think a year. I think it's been over a year. About a year. They, they, they've been married. And how well did you know him? Did you ever have occasion to see him when you would be visiting your yeah, daughters? Yeah, so I, I went up a few times to visit the girls. He was there, and um, one time he showed me the girls. I uh, had the girls get their report cards and show me their report cards. And, and stuff like that. They they always did good with me, you know. I have no bad re no bad reports of bad things to say about anybody, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you know. And, you know, it's just it's just uh, I still to this day still can't believe what's going on. And you know, it's just I, I have no fingers to point at anybody to point them at. It's just you know it's you know I hope I hope there'll be some answers answered. You know, that's, that's what I'm asking for. What do you think?